Today's math puzzle comes from the AHSME math competition in the year 1985. And it tells us to suppose that A and B are both positive, and it gives us two equations, the first of which tells us that A to the B power is equal to B to the A power, and the second of which tells us that B is equal to 9A. And it asks us to find the value of A. And we're going to find the value of A, and we're also going to find the value of B. All right, let's jump into this. First, what we're going to do is we're going to substitute this second equation into this first equation here. So we get from that a to the 9a, that's by plugging in 9a for b on this left-hand side, is equal to 9a to the a power on the right-hand side. And again, that's just by plugging in 9a for b here. Okay, but now we're going to group this a little bit. We're going to kind of group this down so that we have a to the 9 to the a power using exponent rules, and that's going to be equal to 9a to the a power. And notice now we have two things, one on each side, where we have something raised to the a power. So we'll go ahead and take the eighth root of this, not the eighth, but the a t h, the a root of this. And that'll give us a to the 9 is equal to 9a. Okay, but now notice that because we have this stipulation that A and B are both positive, we can divide both sides by A because we know that it's a positive number. If we weren't sure if it was a positive number, we couldn't do this because that would eliminate our possibilities where A would be zero. But because we know that A is positive, we're allowed to do this. So dividing both sides by A, that gives us A to the eighth is equal to nine. And then taking the eighth root of both sides gives us A is equal to the eighth root of nine, or the fourth root of three. So we know that a is equal to the fourth root of three. I'll go ahead and put that here. So to find our value for b, all we have to do is multiply this value by nine. So we get b is equal to nine times three to the one fourth. But we know that nine is three to the second power. So we can go ahead and simplify this down by doing 3 squared times 3 to the 1 fourth. But we know from exponent rules that we just need to add these together. So b is equal to 3 to the 9 fourths power. Okay, so that's our answer for b. This is our answer for a. And that's our final solution. I think that's enough for now.